These are 10 amazing animal parents. 10. Yellow-Headed Jawfish We're nominating the Yellow-Headed Jawfish Dad to be Dad of the Year. Yellow-Headed Jawfish are found in the Caribbean and can usually only be spotted with their head and upper bodies peeking out of their burrows. They are very territorial and don't often stray too far from home. Once the eggs are laid, the father will cram them all in his mouth and occasionally rotate them to keep them hydrated and clean. It is his job to protect his eggs until they are hatched. Once the eggs finally do hatch, the dad will spend time feeding since he wasn't able to eat while looking after the eggs. As soon as they hatch, the babies are on their own and swim away. Talk about a thankless job. 9. Polar Bears Polar bear moms have a unique way of giving birth. After getting pregnant, female polar bears begin a non-stop feast because they need to double their body weight in order to have enough milk to feed their young through the winter. As summer turns to fall, the polar bear moms begin to make her den. Once completed, she begins to hibernate and often gives birth to her young while she is sleeping. When the cubs are born, they weigh about 2 pounds each, but they will continue to nurse through the winter, and by the time the spring comes, they can weigh up to 30 pounds each. Once they leave the den, they will play for a couple of weeks to get used to their new surroundings. Then they will head to the sea ice, where the mother will hunt seals to try to regain some of the weight she lost over the winter. Over the next few years, the mother will keep close watch over her young, protecting them from predators like male polar bears, and teach them how to hunt so they can survive on their own. 8. Orangutans Orangutans are another species in which the mother alone raises her child. Orangutans habit the rainforests of Sumatra and Borneo. They only have a child once every nine years, and there's a reason for that. Orangutan mothers look after their child for the first eight years, longer than any other single parent animal. And because they spend so much time with their child, the bond between them is exceptionally strong. There is much the mother needs to teach her child, like how to navigate the jungle, how to avoid danger, and where to find edible fruit to eat. Another skill that is passed down is nest building. Learning how to build a nest high up in the trees starts early, beginning at six months, and taking three to four years to develop. 7. Galapagos Sea Lion The sea lions of the Galapagos Islands have perfected their parenting technique. Groups of up to 30 females give birth on a secluded beach, which is continuously protected by a single male sea lion. All the mothers are part of his house harem, and as such they help each other to raise their young. They do this by sharing the workload. Some watch over the nursery pool, which is sort of a sealed daycare, where moms can drop off their young to play with other kids while they look for food. Other moms take older offspring to the shallow water to help them practice their hunting skills, often by chasing the marine iguanas found on the island. 6. Strawberry Poison Dart Frog Another dynamic parenting duo are the strawberry poison dart frogs. Measuring only the size of a fingernail, these diminutive frogs more than make up for their size. It begins when the female lays her eggs on the rainforest floor, while the males keep guard to protect the eggs from predators. In addition to that, the dad also has another very important job. He must urinate on the eggs every day to keep them moist. Yuck! Once the eggs hatch and the tadpoles are born, the mother frog must carry each tadpole to their own pool of water because if they all stay together, they will cannibalize each other. Once the babies are separated, the mom then visits each one once a day to lay an unfertilized egg for them to eat. She does this for almost two months until the frogs are old enough to find their own food. Also during this time, the male frog continually keeps watch to make sure no predators gain access to his children. 5. A Delhi Penguin The Adeli Penguins should be nominated for Parents of the Year. Both mom and dad go to extraordinary lengths to raise their young in the freezing Antarctic. It begins with the males who once a year make a 3,100 mile journey to the nesting area in order to prepare the nest for his companion. He must pile stones high up off the freezing ground to make sure the eggs don't freeze. When his mate finally arrives, they both take turns keeping the eggs warm because if an 
egg is left uncovered for more than five minutes, it will never hatch. Once the eggs do hatch, the parents take turns going fishing to feed their ravenous young. One parent will stay to protect the children while the other fishes and vice versa. 4. Caribbean Flamingo The Caribbean flamingos, also known as the American flamingos, have a unique way to raise their young. Unlike many mammals, which depend solely on the mother for food, both Caribbean flamingo parents are able to feed their young. They do this by producing a nutrient-rich red milk in a pouch near their throat. This milk is full of fat and protein, which allows their young to feed before their bills are ready for real food. Both parents are able to make this milk because they both produce a hormone called prolactin. And this unusual milk is what gives the babies their pink coloring. While the baby's coloring gets brighter because of this, it has the opposite effect on the parents. They begin to lose their color, turning pale and washed out as they care for their young. 3. Giant Pacific Octopus For the giant Pacific octopus, the largest octopus species in the world, caring for their babies fulfills their mission in life. And the giant Pacific octopus doesn't do anything small. When they lay their eggs, they do it 100,000 at a time. Once the eggs are laid, the mother octopus's sole focus is to make sure the eggs are clean and supplied with oxygen. The mother octopus stands constant guard looking after her eggs for the six months it takes them to hatch. She does so to the detriment of herself, as she doesn't eat during this time and dies once the eggs hatch and she knows they are safe. 2. Weddell Seal It's hard being a single mom, even harder when you have to raise your kids in one of the most inhospitable places on earth. Just ask the Weddell Seals. The Weddell Seals live in the Antarctic. A Weddell Seal's pregnancy lasts 11 months, and then she has two weeks to feed the baby before nudging them into the water. In order to get the baby ready for the ice-cold waters, the mom's milk contains up to 60% fat, enough to nourish the baby and help them develop the thick blubber they will need to swim in the freezing waters. And learning to swim is the easy part. She also has to teach her baby how to navigate both above and below the ice, how to locate holes in the ice to come up for air, and how to make holes in the ice with their teeth so they don't get trapped underneath. 1. African Elephant For African elephants, it really does take a village to raise a child, or in this case, a herd. African elephants roam in herds of females, led by a matriarch, the oldest of the females. These elephants only have babies every three to four years, primarily because their pregnancies last two years. Once the babies are born, the herd protects them from predators by circling around them and keeping them in the middle whenever danger is near. Sometimes elephant calves are stolen by rivals, and at those times, the full might of the herd is shown when they show up to claim their own. Which animal parent do you think is most amazing? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more fun videos like this one. Thanks for watching.